So I figured we'd have some fun in the sun. Shit. Sicario with a minigun. Oh shit, where? <laughs> Did you just fake me out? <laughs> I figured we have some fun in the sun. Uh, we're actually going to be exploring the largest salt desert in the world. And ironically, in real life, it's not sunny at all. It's actually raining cats and dogs outside. There's lightning, apparently. I, I heard a tornado siren, but I think I'm okay. Computer is still on, so that's nice. But in the world of Ghost Recon Wildlands, it's sunny, beautiful, and gorgeous. And the largest salt desert in the world should be just straight ahead. Had a nice little, um, nice little road trip. We're not in the same van that we started out in. In fact, we had to swap a few cars. We encountered a few strong-armed Sicarios along the way, but it's been one heck of a trek and we're finally here. We started out uh, all the way back, yeah, all the way back uh, from El Sueño, actually. No, but seriously, we started all the way back over here, uh, somewhere near the Hunt Lodge, and yeah, this is the Salt Flat. And it looks amazing. I can't wait to, I can't wait to see it. I'm actually really fascinated by Salt Flats. Especially the salt flat, the salt desert. I've always wanted to visit it. I don't know, it just seems like something that would be really, really cool to see in person. And I... What the hell was that? I'm just gonna ignore that flare. <laughs> I'm just gonna keep driving. We are so close to the salt flat, I can't stop now. I'm actually playing a call with my girlfriend. She's uh, in the passenger seat. Completely outfitted with silenced weapons. We're ready to go, ready to roll. If we find anything dangerous out here. I've actually been playing a lot of Horizon Zero Dawn lately, so I actually wouldn't blink twice if we found some sort of a giant machine, like a trap jaw or something out here, but man, even in a video game, that is pretty striking. Alright, looks like this is the last stop for gasoline and supplies, but we're already stocked up. Got plenty of gas in the road trip van, creepy road trip van, and we got plenty of ammunition. And honestly, if this is real life, I would stock up with four silencers because those don't last too long. Oh shit. Wait a second, you see that? That's an internet helicopter. That's really gonna get up my craw. Man, Unidad helicopters are the worst. They're extremely dangerous too. Alright, let's take a look around. So apparently, lithium-ion batteries are made from some sort of material. Was that a little roadside fruit stand? I'm gonna check this out. That is so cute. Except no one's there. <laughs> oh my! Oh, never mind. Somebody is there. Oh God. Are those potatoes? Oh, that's a lot of potatoes. Huh. Yeah, I'd be scared of me too. I was like, whoa, holy shit, you guys have a lot of guns. Yeah, we do. And we're about to use them, because, uh, of course not. I, I, I think we're going to go inside that military base. I don't see a whole lot out here, actually. And I completely forgot about my derailed subject. I, I think, and I'm not sure, so don't quote me on this, I think that lithium-ion batteries uh, are actually made with a material found in salt flats. Could be wrong about that, but pretty interesting. This is actually really cool looking. This is beautiful. I, I can't even imagine being here in real life. Is Does it really go as far as the horizon could see? Set in the distance, almost like a ship. You see that? Is that beyond the game? No, it is not. I did not see that on the map before. Maybe it was always there, but uh, I, I always feel like we just found something that's secret. It's a little secret location. Oh, shit, 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 shit. That is not a secret location. Santa Blanca drug cartel is already there. Whatever this place is. Target spotted a Sicario leader. Looks kind of skittish. Ideal for spreading a little fear. I got a third. All right, drone is spotting. Target number five. A Sicario leader and five of his cronies. Unfortunately, I just, I just got one partner with me, and that's Bob. <laughs> If we had four, this would be no sweat, but with two people, I don't know about this. Right, let's wait for him to stand still before we open fire. All right, Bob's going to take that one. I'll take this one. Bob has acquired her target. And I've acquired my target. 
Shit. Target it down. I wasn't ready for that. So far, so good. Just one more. The lieutenant's trying to the escape. Run. Beautiful, beautiful. Do not open fire on the lieutenant. No! Stop it! Stop it, Bob! Stop it! Shit! Bob, you stop that! You stop that! You gotta capture this guy. Oh my god, he's getting away. No, no, no. Shit. Uh-uh, uh-uh, uh-uh. What the hell, does this guy have bulletproof tires? No, he doesn't, he's slowing down. Yes! Yes! <laughs> yeah! You can't run! You can't even hide, it's a salt flat! Oh, shit. We need that helicopter's coming pretty close. I want you to spread the Clear. Word. There are some new Sicarios in town, and any man who stands with Santa Blanca should count himself among the dead. Tell your friends. They won't see us coming until it's too damn late. Okay. Está claro, pues. I will. I will. Much as I like fucking with these assholes, part of me thinks we shouldn't have let them walk away. No, nah, man. Humiliation's worse than a bullet to a macho dude like that. The rebels are gonna love this. You know what? I'm not so sure it is. I'm pretty sure a bullet to the head is pretty much worse than anything you can imagine. <laughs> well, except for torture, but that wasn't torture. Even though my speech was pretty badass. What is this? Just, is that luggage? I guess that's just luggage. Well... I got one of those cartel medals here. Some Sicario is gonna miss this. I'm not so sure this was a plane crash. I think that the Sicarios may have shot this thing down. Weird. There's a lot of blood among the wreckage. Alright, let's take the Sicario helicopter. We're gonna need this thing to oversee the base operations. Crap. That's the wrong seat. Sure are a lot of lights and switches up here. Oh yeah, that's what you want to hear from your pilot. So how did they even build this thing out here? Look at this. Did they just import a bunch of rocks and dirt? Alright, this place is huge. They got an airstrip. They have five hangars. Jesus. Whoa, 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 whoa. They got watchtowers. Whoa, 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 whoa. They got watchtowers. Shit. Shit. Missiles inbound. Oh, that's not good. I think we're moving low enough where they can't actually lock onto us, but uh... Yeah, let's come out of the helicopter and let's move into the dirt. Nice and quiet. Nice and low. I think it was too loud anyway. Actually, it's perfect camouflage, though. Look at that. It's white. You know? Kind of blend into the clouds in the sky. You blend into the cell field. Alright, so they spotted a helicopter. They're going to be looking for that, but they're not going to be looking for two ghosts. Just like I said to the Zakaria, we're gonna move in nice and quiet. Ain't that right, Bob? Shit. We don't have a way in over here. The wall's too high and we got barbed wire. This is what I love about this game, though. You can go about these encounters whatever way you see fit. Which means you can do a bit of exploring, you know, you can do a bit of reconnaissance, and we have found a crack in the wall. Don't go in, Bob. Bob? You stay oh shit, they got this thing jammed. Damn it! Alright, we gotta figure out where that jammer is. Shit. Look at that helicopter's on the move. Wait a second. Job is approaching. Yeah, I know, Bob. Just give me a sec. Beautiful. Good shot, good shot. Alright, so where's that jammer? We're gonna need drones if we wanna do this thing right. I don't want to steal one of those planes. It's pretty tempting. I don't see the jammer anywhere. All right, let's uh, make sure the rest of these bunkers and outposts are cleared out. I guess. I got a second target. Nice oh my God, Bob! What are you doing? Oh my God! We're still all right. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. <laughs> you almost gave me a heart attack there. <laughs> I thought they were going to be alerted. So, uh, oh shit, shit, shit. So Bob actually can't hear me because, um, well, my microphone's just feeding to my recording software right now. So uh, she's she's just going out for my cues, <laughs> which is actually pretty damn impressive. We got some type of a ESP thing going on right here. Oh shit! You know what? I just realized this place looks like Mad Max. Get my Mad Max uniform on. Hopefully nothing happens between me like 
coming to the loading screen and coming out of the loading screen. Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! Helicopter spotted me! Son of a bitch! It was not worth putting this goddamn costume on. Damn it! Damn it! Alright, think fast, think fast, think fast. Uh God, I got a block! I'm reaching yeah, down, but there's nothing it. there! Um how about we just hide inside of the building? God, I hate these new that helicopters. We got ground forces. I don't even see these Stop bastards. Me. Wait, wait. I think I saw one. On the outside. I don't even know where Bob is. Bob! Oh shit, Bob is down. Bob is on the ridge. Helicopter saw Bob. Helicopter sees me. Alright, once the helicopter's circling back around, which I think they are now, I'm gonna move up and get Bob. I got you, Bob! Don't worry about- Shit, I don't got you. Contact. Oh god. Oh god. Run! Run! Get the hell out of here! Oh my god! Woo! That was close. Alright, so this is kind of unconventional, but I mean, if you want to play Ghost Recon Wildlands this way, you're free to. Shit. Shit, it's just not smart to play it like goddamn Rambo. Especially if you don't have that awesome, sick bow and arrow, which I do not. That's some pretty cool guns, but I don't really think that it compares. Who the hell was in that truck? Alright, Bob, we're gonna have to make a break for it. We're not gonna last in here, it's too wide open. <laughs> Bob was way ahead of me. Can I get a revive? Beautiful. Beautiful. See, Bob, that's what I love about Bob. Bob doesn't leave you behind. Unless it's dangerous. So let's hope that I don't come in the building. Thanks. Right, we gotta get out of here. Stat. Let's just move. This reminds me of a mission in Gra 2. I don't know if you guys ever played Gra 2, but if you did, leave a comment. Because I was a big fan of that game. It was fantastic. I played Gra 1 and Gra 2. I think I prefer right Gra 2, but I can't remember. It's been so many years. Anyway, there's this super intense mission in Gra 2. Maybe you'll even know what I'm talking about, but... Um... I feel like it was a search and rescue mission. It was this compound. And... Most of it was close quarters combat, but before you reach the actual compound itself, you had a bunch of patrols on the outskirts, and I'm pretty sure the LZ that they dropped you off in was, uh... It was wide open wilderness. I almost want to say it was a farmland, but it wasn't. There's a lot of sand, I know that much, but... Anyway, it, it's just stuck out to me as... Holy shit, rebels. Rebels are attacking you to have forces. Oh, yeah. That is exactly what I like to see. Holy shit, there's bullet drop. <laughs> nice! That is also what I like to see. Anyway, that one mission that I played in Gra 2, at least I think it was Gra 2, whatever, it, it, it stood out to me, even though it doesn't sound like it, it, it stood out to me as one of the most intense experiences in gaming that I've ever had. That's and the uh, last mission of the first Splinter Cell game. That was pretty intense. That was pretty legit. I may be misremembering that, or I may be remembering that as being more difficult than it would be to me right now, but back in the day, man, when I played Splinter Cell 1 on the GameCube, that was intense. That was like, that was the tops of intensity. It didn't get more intense than that. Where's Bob? Bob? Alright, Bob's good. Oh, shit! I'm not good. I am not good! Where the hell are these guys? Oh, shit, helicopter. Oh, thank God there's an interior. Well, this is actually pretty cozy. Oh god, I hear some gangbangers. We should have swooped and cleared. Oh shit, Bob's gonna be in trouble. They're on the turret. I got you, Bob! Don't worry about it! Oh shit, Bob's down. Bob is down! Where the hell is- there he is. I gotta go prone. Oh my god, I don't think I'm gonna be able to last. I just gotta- just gotta sit tight, heal up a little bit, go after Bob. Alright. I'll be healed up in like two seconds, so I gotta get ready. Okay! They're not gonna wait for me, so I'm not gonna wait for them. Let's go! Shit! Shit! Tuck and roll! Oh my god. Oh my god. Hang on, Bob! Hang on! I'm coming after you! Watch out for that Helen. Oh, that sniper. That sniper's gonna be trouble. I can't wait for him. 
Mm, now is not the time to play whack-a-mole. Now is the time to save Bob. Just in time, just in time. No! No! Bob! Shit. God damn it. It was just a second too late. I swear I press square in time. I mean X. Ugh. Narrow mess. Shit, what the hell is that? Oh. I am down. Bob is right behind me. My guardian angel. Wait, what the hell happened? What? I'm gonna feel real bad about this for about five seconds, but... That is the only vehicle around for miles, so, uh... I I'm just gonna take it. And to make it easier on that poor sap selling whatever the hell he's selling, I'll just see if I can sneak up around that van, get inside before he notices, pick up Bob, explore the rest of these cell... Where the hell is Bob, anyway? Damn. That outpost is really far away. Alright. Let's beat our feet. Let's hump it. This is actually kind of hauntingly beautiful at night. Is that going to be that helicopter? Yes, it is. Luckily, I don't think he's searching for me. Right, I'm just going to not worry about that. I'm not going to stress myself. Oh, God, this is awkward. Uh, I'm sorry. I need this. I need it. I'm sorry. All right, Bob. I'm coming for you, Bob. Wow, they are really far away. All right, so we have explored part of the salt land. This is the largest salt desert in the world, after all. We still got some more to explore. I'm considering going back to the military base because I'm pretty sure they have an APC. I want to check that out. I want to see what's up with that. Maybe steal one of their attack helicopters. That'd be pretty sweet. But uh, oh, Bob's behind me. Shit. That's just great. Glasses all banged up. At least Bob didn't crash into me. You know, I like that truck better. Let's take the truck. So we have explored some of this, all right? And a little bit of this. But we haven't explored any of this. Yeah. Let's just see where the road takes us. I, I'm not even a set of marker. It'll be a nice, peaceful drive in the middle of the night. The salt flats with all the creepy people just walking out of nowhere. Let's keep our eyes peeled. I see something in front of us, but I think there might be something that we are not seeing over there. Like that helicopter or plane crash with the helicopter sitting beside it. That would be kind of tricky to see unless you're looking out for it. Oh shit! It's an airstrip! That's gonna be handy. And that is a convoy. Alright! Uh, this is uh, this is gonna be really stupid of me, but it's also gonna look really cool. They go off the road a ways. I'm gonna set some mines down and we're gonna blow this into Kingdom Come. Right, let's be quick about this. Where are my mines? Alright. Mine one. Mine two. And now let's move. I wanna avoid as much suspicion as possible. <laughs> Shit, they are so close. Oh, fuck! That was not how it was supposed to go down! How did I not see that go? Oh, no, 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 no! 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 Oh, fuck yeah. Oh, thank God. Alright, we took down the, uh, uh, lead defense of the patrol. Now we just have the helicopter to worry about and two more of the Hummers. And, of course, you know, the... What the hell, he's still alive. Oh, he's just smoking. He's just smoking. That's not good. That's not good. That's not good. He's not stopping. Nobody's stopping! This is such a stupid idea. What the fuck was I thinking? Alright, where the hell is that APC? Gotta be in here somewhere. Beautiful, they don't see us. They know we're here, but they don't know where we are. So as long as Bob and I stay... ...quiet, which is no longer a viable option. Great. The crappy thing is, I have no idea where this APC is. I, I don't even know if it's inside of this base. I'm assuming it is. Because in promotional art, I have seen the APC in the Salt Flats. So, <laughs> I'm really just going on a wild goose chase here.
He's waiting for, but he's not shooting us for some reason. Shit. Oh, there it is. Oh my god, it's here! Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Shit, Bob is down. Oh god. Damn it. Oh, that is just the worst. Granted, I've gone down like way more than Bob has, but uh, the timing! It's the timing that I'm mad about, that's all. Oh god, Bob, hang on. Oh, I'm hit hard. I'm hit hard, I'm hit bad. Oh my god, get up, Bob. Bob, get up! Uh, thank you. Bob, get in the APC, please, 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 please. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> god, that grenade didn't destroy Bob. Woo! Yes! Alright! Wreak havoc. Do what you gotta do. Just just blast away, man. Oh yeah. This is when we bring the war to the Sicarios. Oh shit. Oh! Oh, that's not gonna be good for the APC. I mean, it's armor, but it's not invisible. Oh god. All right, you know what? This thing's actually going down pretty fast. Uh, I have lost control of the APC. Oh, that sucks. That's that's some major suckage. Keep, Bob, can you fire? Is that locked out? Shit. Well, that sucked. I had high hopes for that APC. High hopes. Honor roll hopes. And it turned out to be a dud. I'm actually kind of shocked at how quickly it went down. I mean, granted, it was being bombarded with uh, mini guns from helicopters. I'm pretty sure there were missiles. There were definitely frag grenades and also a ginormous uh, canister of gasoline that blew up right in front of it. Still, <laughs> even still, I've seen movies. I've seen mo in, in movies, APCs are invincible. They're like tanks. Actually, yeah. In movies, APCs are tanks, but they hold more people, and, like, the guns are faster. Military people are cringing, hearing me talk about APCs like that. <laughs> I watched the movies! The movies, they got the, they got the fast guns, they got the, they got the whole armies in there. It's like D-Day, a little portable D-Day. Curious to see what else is in this cell flat. So we got a... Enormous military base. We got an alpaca salesman with a creepy white van. We got a crashed plane site with a hell. Shit, 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 shit. We got lots of Unidad helicopters. We know that much. We are very familiar with that. Where are we in the salt flat? Oh, almost out of bounds. Okay. What is this? So the convoy is going past a checkpoint. I guess that's all that is a checkpoint. Yeah, we're safe to go past it. Kind of. Kind of. Yeah, that's actually, uh, that's actually a military installation. <laughs> Thought maybe it was just a friendly little backwater gas station, but no. No, it is not. Hey, we got something over here. Looks like they're doing a little bit of mining. Let me check this out first. Train graveyard. What? That where old trains go to die. When the local mines went bust, the companies left all their trains behind. Keep your heads down. We don't want to say a big hello until we find something. If that's a tour group, I'll leave my fucking boot. You think this is connected to Reed? Only one way to find out. What about the friendlies? We'll cut them loose if we can, but it's not our priority. Clear? Clear. Oh shit, guys. Guys, these are rebel forces. That was the plane that we saw flying overhead just a few minutes ago. Well, like 30 seconds ago. <laughs> How the hell did they crash? 
Was I flying that thing? All right, let's go check this out. Actually, looks a lot further away than uh than it was like 20 seconds ago. It's not far away at all. Okay, that's looking kind of weird. Just a bunch of mounds. Mmm, mounds. I could go for some mounds right now. Love eating mounds. I don't even know what is what is this place? What, what, what is this? They package up sand and sell it? That's what they're doing. All right, uh, final order of business. We're gonna go capture that helicopter, from that little base. Oh wait, more mounds. I prefer almond joy to mounds. I gotta say, love me some almond joy. Mounds are okay. I mean, I would not say no right now, but if if I had a choice, it would be holy shit. This is a military base. I guess they're. Dear God. They're packaging up the salt and selling it as cocaine. Santa Blanc is more evil than I thought. Dear God. Keep those weapons down. We oh, that's a civvy. <laughs> oh, that could have looked bad. That could have looked real bad for Uncle Sam. Where the hell are the Sicario? This place is clear. Alright, bag him and tag him, Bob. I'll bag this one, you bag the other. We'll leave a marker so the rebels can pick up the supplies later. Beautiful. All right, what is this? This thing's got many guns. This is, uh, this is Santa Blanca. Yet, nobody's here. I'll fly. This is unguarded. You know how much this helicopter is? Jesus, it's gotta be hundreds of thousands of dollars at least. Shit, I mean, if the American government bought this thing, it would be millions. All right, this isn't the helicopter that we need, though. The helicopter that we need is right over here. Well, the helicopter that the Rebellion needs. We don't need this thing. Alright, where's that checkpoint at? Uh... Oh, right over here. It's kind of hard to believe exactly how expansive this open world is. I was expecting it to feel really, really empty when I first played the beta. Or rather, when I first uh, saw the E3 trailers for this game, but... It's it's not empty. Not at all. And that was a smooth landing. Sarcasm. No, but uh really I I have open world fatigue. I really do. But the emphasis on this game being open world isn't to be filler. It's not to waste your time. It's just to give you more options for dynamic gameplay when you're going about your missions. I appreciate that. I'm sick He's of fetch quests. Right. You take that one, Bob, I'll take this one. Let's grab it. I'll have a lot of supplies on this thing. I need this. You ready, Bob? Quiet my top Bob? Bob? There we go. Nice one. Nice sink shot. Oh, shit. Shit. Beautiful, Bob. Shit, they stole sauce. Oh, my God. They're getting in the helicopter. Dear God. God! No! That we're taking it down. <laughs> if I can't have it, they can't have it either. Bob, let's go. Fast. Come on, come on. Beat your feet, beat your feet, beat your feet. Where the hell's that helicopter going? Uh nice. Nice. I should be able to catch up with him. This thing's loaded with four mini guns. There's no way there's no way, no how they're making that out of here alive. I should have utilized the drone. Bob, thank you. You understand me. Damn it. I'm selfish. The are going to have to go without for a bit. <sighs> you know what, Bob? I'm not going to leave you. I'm going to join you. Coming in hot! Coming in very hot! I'm going down with the ship. I'm going down with the helicopter. Shit, man. If, if I can't steal that other helicopter, I may as well crash this one. And crash it in style. Just a hell of a lot of gunfire. Minigun bullets and dead Sicarios. That was a nice kill. You see that? That kill deserved a Wilhelm scream. Oh, yeah. Oh, this is going to turn out real well. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Get in the minigun. Oh, my God. Minigun. Minigun! Shit. 
it's it's destroyed. Helicopter's gone. You can't get the minigun. Except they didn't tell me that! That would have been very handy. Anyway, Bob is too far away for this revive. <laughs> We've done some exploring in the salt flats. I don't even know what level's supposed to be. What is this? What is this? How many stars? Five solid stars. Alright, so that's supposed to be high difficulty. We are, what, what are we, level eight? Yeah, we're more of a uh, two-star difficulty. Two, three-star, not five-star. But it was fun. I enjoy the self flats. They're really cool. I, I like this base, too. It's got everything. It's got planes, big planes, small planes, APCs. Really the only thing that's missing is tanks or, uh, like, mobile artillery. That would be pretty cool. It's got assault helicopters. It's got a uh, mini assault helicopter. Whatever. It's got everything. The Salt Flats is a beautiful vacation destination. Please visit it and visit this uh, dangerous road as well. If you want to see more Goats Recon Wildlands or if you just adore, if you just enjoyed yourself, subscribe. Leave a like. Join La Familia Cocaina. Join uh, La Rebellion against La Sala Blanca. And I'll see you guys in our next Ghost Recon Wildlands adventure and live stream. Until then, good hunting out there, ghosts. I'll see you soon.